Today's exciting episode, I'm going to show you what I have in this kayak. The motor is probably the main thing that I like about it, just because you can cover any water you like. You can go four miles one way, four miles the other way. And you can also stand on it, and it is very, very stable. As you guys can see in my videos, I was standing on it, walking over to the top, I mean the front and the back, and very stable kayak, guys. It's basically like a boat, in my opinion. Cover any water, and it's so stable. All right, first fishing rod holders right here. You got one right here in the front. You got one right here in the back. So got one right here, these two right here. I also have this little crate right here that I'm putting in there. That has two more, so there's four right here. Possibly put one, two, three, five rods in there. In tournaments and stuff like that, people want to get really fast out. They want to catch the fish, not switch out baits and stuff like that. So that is very good for that. Second, the storage in this kayak is amazing. I put my baits right here in this little pocket. Pockets for more baits. You can even, even put your phone in there. Nothing will fall out. Second of all, right here cup holders you got two cup holders one on the right and one on the left for all day you want a cup holder and you, you can put gatorade water in there too so the storage is very very nice you can put anything in there i can see baits uh cell phone whatever um you can see from here put a gopro right here that gets all the fish films all the fish i catch hook sets whatever we use like hack hands and stuff like that but i'm not a big fan of hack hands so i use the front mount and the chest mount um, it's amazing, you can put rod holders, baits, uh, cell fins, so much storage in here, you can store everything in there. And on the back is more storage. You can even put book bags, whatever's in there. So, I mean, like I said, this kayak is amazing. Cover any water you want. Motor in it is perfect. And even if it dies, people are saying, what happens if it dies? You can just paddle in, not that big of a deal. So, I mean, the seat's very comfortable too. The right. seat is so comfortable. It's just amazing. I can sit here all day, grab this line, throw it out, do whatever I want. So, I mean, yeah, basically it's not heavy at all. I can lift it up. I'll show you right now how I lift it up. Um, just grab this handle, lift up, not that heavy. I put it on top of my car too. So, I mean, we got everything, in my opinion, done. We got, uh, Got the rod holders, the storage. I mean, basically that's it and how I set up my camera gear. Um, yeah, so we'll be doing a lot of trips in this. I know you want to see more streams and stuff like that, but I really want to use the motor. I like the motor, that's why I bought it for the motor. So I'll be doing a lot more lakes and things like that. If you want a kayak like this, I, if you want a kayak like this, I'd highly recommend going to get one. I know it's $2,500, but it's worth it. It lasts forever and again, you can cover any water you want. So like I said, that's about it for today's exciting episode of Hugging Bass 92. You guys can do me a big, big favor. Hit that like button and also to hit that subscribe button. As always, catch big fish. Have a great day.